This shit goes way too fucking hard, dog, for no reason. Like, I'm just standing here. <laughs> Anyways, what's good, YouTube? Apple 92 here back again once again. What's poppin', everybody? Uh, we are here to continue playing through Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield, Pokemon Sticks and Pokemon Stones, Pokemon Skull and Pokemon Bones, Pokemon Fire and... I, no, it doesn't work. The alliteration's not there. Anyways, we started this LP as a stream LP, but I'm going to continue it here on YouTube separately. I'm going to kind of sort of play through the exact same way. Like, I'm not going to stop and make, like, rigid 30-minute episodes every single time. I'm kind of just going to, like, sit here and play for two hours and just ch 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 chop it up for you guys. Um, but I really only want to do that because, like, it's a brand new game, and I really just want to be immersed and stay immersed for, like, the session that I'm in here. Hey, bitch! Wake it up! So... Yeah, but anyways, um, it's been a minute since I've played, but for the most part, I think I remember everything. Um, apparently, I was told by uh, one of my boys that apparently I could have skipped a lot of what I've already done. It was tutorial, um, and I somehow I could have skipped it by catching a mon in that forest or some shit, but I could swear that I tried to catch a mon, but I didn't have any pokeballs. I don't know. It doesn't matter to me. I'm not mad that I did it. Who gives a fuck? It's a brand new Pokemon game. But anyways, we are here in the wild area. Hopefully today, well, maybe not in today's episode, but in today's little session of episodes, uh, we can get to the first gym because I'm very excited to see what's in here. I um, wanted to reiterate because I don't know if the episodes that ended up on YouTube included this, but this is a 100% blind playthrough. I have not kept up with any updates about this game. I heard that there's DLC, but aside from like the starters and Galarian Weezing because he's in Pokemon Go, I don't know a goddamn thing about this game. Normally, you know, we are on top of news updates and this and that and yada yada yada, but this time around, I intentionally wanted to remain as ignorant as possible to everything in this game so that when we play through it, it's like actual new shit, actual new reactions, actual new everything. So that is one of the like the main reason why I want to just record in like one big session and just remain immersed and not have to stop, start, stop, start, stop, start, stop, start. But I do still have my random name generator opened up here. So yeah, yeah. Ugh. Ugh. let me strap in here. Ugh. And get ready to play some motherfucking Pokemon! Woo! Now, <laughs> I know I said I was gonna change the camera from over here to over here, but I think what I'm gonna do instead is I'm gonna find a way to move the TV from over here to over here so that I can like sit here and you know I'm still somewhat facing you guys. So I'm gonna try and play off this screen um, for this session, um, but. This week or next week or sometime, I'm gonna come up with a solution for that so that I can um, basically do everything. Cause like I like the camera angle being right here for when I'm playing computer games. Cause you know, like it works, but <laughs> this TV is basically like 90 degrees to the right. So, anyways, enough talking. Let's fucking get into this bitch. I need my controller. And Sasha's over there going ham. So if you hear any noise in the background. That's what it is. All right, boys and girls, let us get a uh, quick team recap because <laughs> I don't know what the fuck I got. We got our boy Modesto. Oh, I, I forgot, like the fucking experience share is permanent in this game. Everything you do gives you experience. So like the only way that you could not train something is to put it in the PC. Everything gets experience no matter what. So what's stopping me from just like solo running this game with Modesto until I encounter a electric type? Or a grass type. Like, nothing. I just fuck shit up, dog. Anyways, Modesto is chilling. Water Pulse, Pound, Growl, and Bind. Chen. I think this nigga is Rookidy. Rookidy. <laughs> Peck, Power Trip, Leer, and Hone Claws. We have Nicket. No. Is that Clara? Clara? Nicket? Clara the Nicket? Stop saying that. Beat up, quick attack, tail whip, and home claws. Antony, and Antoninus, Antonin, Antonin, Antoninus, Antoninus, my nigga Anton, the Choodle, who's like Mudkip, like went at it with a Squirtle, and this is what popped out. 
Water Gun Tackle and Bite. She's like, I don't need two water types on the team. I'm just catching shit. Johan, a Squovit, who uh, has Tackle, Tail Whip, and Bite. And then Yamper. No. Inigo. Inigo? Inigo? Or Yamper? Everyone's dying of heart disease. Okay? <laughs> Nuzzle, Tackle, and Tail Whip. So, that's what we're rocking for now. So, apparently, we are making our way to... If I understand correctly, to this next city. Because we were sponsored by the champion. And we have to go through the wild area first. So. Let's go through the fucking wild area. <laughs> Hi there, would you like to rest your Pokemon? Sure. Thank you. Hey, at least I'm getting like flashbacks of like Blaze Black when you had to battle the nurses and the nurses would have like dummy stupid Pokemon and you would lose a Pokemon in your Nuzlocke just trying to get healed. Oh, oh, PTSD. Flashbacks. Nuzlocke flashbacks. This isn't even a Nuzlocke. Look at that. What are we looking at, bro? What the fuck is this portal? This fucking hell, hellscape portal from Doom that's right here in the sky. Is this like a gym in Pokemon Go? That's Motostoke way off that way. And between there and here are countless new Pokemon waiting to be met. Oh, hello. And if it isn't Sonya. Oh, I forgot all about this shit. I forgot all about this. I don't know what voice I gave. My grand gave me a proper earful in her own way. Those two young trainers are setting out on a journey, but what are you doing with your life? <laughs> Where's the option to be like, she right? <laughs> so that why, that that why, that is that why the professor couldn't sponsor one of us? Because she sponsored her own granddaughter? And bro, oh, I skipped that shit. Her glasses are fucking huge. I mean, I guess they got anime eyes, but, like, look at her glasses on top of her head compared to, like, her face. It's fucking huge. Besides, I've been quite curious about the Pokemon you two met in the forest. I just had a 200 IQ! Wait a minute! Hold up! If I'm gonna play off this screen anyways, let me just put it right here. Fuck a TV. Fuck a TV. Fuck a TV, bro. Fuck a TV. Who needs a TV? Who needs television? You have YouTube, Netflix, Hulu. Ah, oh, fuck a TV, bro. What the fuck is a TV, dog? Get that shit out of here, bro. All right. <clears throat> I've been thinking I should look into it so the timing works out fine. <clears throat> if I discover something really huge, then maybe even Grant will admit I've got some talent. That'll never happen. Yikes, being an adult has got its own challenges, huh? <clears throat> I said you needn't worry about it. I'm glad to be on the road. Really, it's been ages. It'll be great fun to fish and camp and rough it outside again. Well, I'm off to go stick my head in as many of these glowing <laughs> glowing red dens as I can find. I'm gonna battle the snot out of a bunch of Dynamax Pokemon and fill another page in the tale of my legend. I still don't know what the fuck Dynamax is. It's just making niggas big. What cheek? Dynamax Pokemon are really on another level, you know. You better Dynamax your partner Pokemon too if you want to take on opponents that strong. You'll find spots here and there in the wild area that emit a red beam of light. If you think you're up to it, check them out. There'll be Dynamax Pokemon lurking in the wild. Can we stop? Can we stop? Thank you. Appreciate it. Nothing's even happened. Sasha barks or Sadie barks. So with that, how about I send you off with a little treat from me? Yo, Pokemon box link. It sounds like I can access my Pokemon box from anywhere. A device that allows you to access the Pokemon storage system. There are some places where it won't work. You can use the Pokemon box link to access your Pokemon boxes while you're on the road. You'll be able to add Pokemon to your party to transfer Pokemon or transfer Pokemon from your party to a box. You can access your boxes by selecting Pokemon from the X menu and then pressing the R button. You can access your boxes by selecting Pokemon from the X menu and then pressing the R button. I've forgotten that already. 
With a Pokemon Box Link, you'll be able to put your Pokemon from your team into your boxes. Or take Pokemon from your boxes to add them to your team. Nice, right? So go wild catching as many so go wild catching as many Pokemon as you'd like and fill in some more of your Pokedex. Don't tell me what to do! The wild area is waiting for you. This is the start of your real adventure. Hmm. All these beams of light. Are these like mini bosses? He's supposed to be like Dynamax Pokemon all over the land, and I'm just supposed to go get my ass whooped. Is that what this is? <laughs> the red light, like, hey, come here to get fucked up. With the Pokemon box link. <clears throat> Alright, thanks. Cool. Cool. Whatever. Hush. I think I have one Pokemon in a box right now. Wow. Whoa! What the fuck? You found a note. Did someone drop it here? There's an item. The large Pokemon you see wandering around in the wild area are strong. If you try battling one, it seems like you're in over your head. Try to run. Run like the wind. So, are you telling me that this Onyx is going to whoop my ass? Because I don't know if you know this, but Onyx is like one of the worst Pokemon ever made. Bro, why the fuck are there so many items around here? A very strong looking onyx. Don't worry, my boy Modesto got this. It's hailing? I'm getting that mixed up with fog. Never mind. Please don't tell me there's fog in this game. That was the worst part of Gen 4. Oh, this thing is level 26! He's cursing. Oh no. He's gonna use rock throw and just Oko me from full. I ain't scared, bro. I ain't scared, bro. Fuck this nigga up, dog. Yeah, boy. Do I outspeed now? Cause he used curse? He did it again! You stupid bitch! He did it again! It's crazy how I caught everything up to this point, but I don't want this fucking onyx. <laughs> fuck this nigga, though. I don't give a fuck about him. Bro. I ain't scared of no fucking onyx. A very strong looking onyx. Eat a dick. What the fuck? Everybody leveling up. <laughs> Look at literally every single person on the team. Every single mod on the team leveled up. Hey, very strong looking Onyx. What is that, an oxymoron? Who the fuck keeps dropping notes? Cooking at your camp can restore HP to your Pokemon and even the PP they need to use their moves over and over again. Pokemon that have fainted and can't battle any longer will perk right up as well, as well with a piping hot plate of curry before them. Is this supposed to be like Breath of the Wild? Visit berry trees to collect plenty of berries so you can always make more curries. Huh. <sighs> I wonder. I'm going to do a little thinking out loud. I know that you guys watching this have probably already played through this game and know all the answers to the questions that I'm asking. But. I feel like the ability to just heal wherever, whenever makes the game very easy. Now, I'm not going to say that that doesn't mean that, like, AI won't be hard or anything like that, but that's the very first thought that pops in my head, like, oh, I can just heal wherever? Okay. Fuck okay, yeah, shake this berry tree. Can a hair cross pop out? Two cherry berries and one orange berry fell from the tree. Shake it more, nigga! Two Pecha Berries and one Cherry Berry fell from the tree. Shake it more, nigga! I can see there's berries in that tree! Keep shaking it, nigga! Keep it going! Shake it more! Thirteen! It's not enough! Shake it more! Nineteen! That's 
exactly what I was. <laughs> I 100% didn't know that this nigga was gonna be in the tree. <laughs> I said, I want a hair cross to pop out. <laughs> so, is this like, is he like the guardian of the tree? If he whoops my ass, do I not get any of the berries? <laughs> I'm rude as shit, dog. I just put, this nigga was probably sleeping, taking a nap. And I just pulled up and started shaking this shit till this motherfucker fell out. Sorry, bro. <clears throat> I apologize wholeheartedly. Thank you, though, my dude. Thank you, though, my dude. <clears throat> so, I was talking to some people, and they were saying that it was going to take me like an hour to get through the wild area. <laughs> so I said, oh, so you mean two hours. <laughs> you picked up the berries that fell from the tree. Eight cherry berries, four orange berries. What happened to my fucking petcha berries, nigga? You're not going to act like that wasn't just on the screen. Do I have no berries? Cause that makes 19. Whoa. An endorsement. This isn't the time to use that. I can't read what the fuck it says. Asshole. We have... I don't know who's what. <laughs> I was gonna say, can I teach somebody Swift? But I don't know who's what. Like, is it are you a special attacker? I think everyone, everyone looks physical to me. What the shit is this? Hey. Oh, you can move the camera. What the fuck is that? Is that a bunnelby? Oh, these are vanillish. Oh, or vanilla. -y. Oh, I think everything's a new Pokemon. So like, I didn't even register like out of all the Pokemon that exist. Does this look like anything I already know? Everything is a new Pokemon. And I was about to say, is that a Bunnelby? Bunnelby. Hey, get your hoppity hop ass out of here. What the fuck is this? Dino or Pokemon Dens. The pillars of red light you'll see in the wild area mark Pokemon Dens. Dynamax Pokemon dwell in these dens, and you'll be able to battle them by investigating the den. You can start the battle on your own or get up to three other players to help you out. So this is like a raid from Pokemon Go. There's a bit of energy trickling out of the den. You gain 50 W. Why calm? Quit. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck 50 W means. Is that like some new, yo, can I fuck up this bit of? I gotta wait for him to come down. Oh. They finally gave us like an open world Pokemon game. Or at least this area is very open world. And that's like my favorite genre of games. It just is. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey. Fuck out of here, dude. So, <clears throat> I'm gonna guess. I don't like making assumptions, assumptions are very bad. But, I'm gonna guess that because it's hailing, that's why there are vanillite here. And if there was a different weather condition out, we would have different Pokemon in this grass. So, I should catch a vanillite while I'm here? Yes? Perhaps? Because who knows when it's gonna be hailing again? I don't really know why it's hailing in-game. It's not hailing here in Arizona. <laughs> it's not hailing in Arizona. <laughs> I mean, that's how Pokemon Go works, doesn't it? That was a crit? What? Bro, uh-uh. I was gonna say, I, I'm gonna catch a Bunnelby too, but I ain't fucking with this But Then again, I can just fucking post up! Make a bonfire! Oh my god. Don't kill yourself.
I have to check on my girls for a second. I hear noises from behind me. Sasha's always up to no good. Always. One of her nicknames is Goblin. She's a fucking goblin. <laughs> okay, fuck a bundle bee. Uh, whatever, I'll get a vanilla or yeah, vanilla later. I keep dropping all these fucking notes. I already know how to use the camera. I've played video games before, bro. And I don't know what the fuck that is in the distance, but that is incredibly complex architectural design and is so superfluous that it hurts me. Like, that looks like maintenance alone is a bitch. Just saying. Metapod. Oh, can I, can I shiny hunt? Can we chain vanilla? Alright, guys, welcome back. We are here to uh, get a shiny vanilla. Vanillish. <clears throat> Something tells me this one's gonna be shiny. If it was actually shiny, though. Oh my god, if it was actually shiny, though. That would have been wild. That would have been fucking wild. Okay, I just want to catch this bitch. Please don't. I said, I'm going to catch a vanilla. Never mind, I don't need to catch a vanilla. I'm going to catch a vanilla. Make up your mind. Make up your mind. What the fuck do you want to do? <clears throat> the bundle bee I'm not too worried about. Unless it's like a day of the week type thing. But the bundle bee I'm not too worried about because... Um, it's common. Like it's not. I don't. I feel like it's not weather dependent. I feel like it's too much of a convenience for it to be hailing and ice types to show up. You know what I mean? And it is this early on in the game. It arguably the worst ice type, bro. <laughs> the worst ice type. <laughs> oh my god! Unable to survive in hot areas. It makes itself comfortable by breathing out cold air. Breathing, breathing out air cold enough to cause snow. It burrows into the snow to sleep. That doesn't even fucking make sense. This nigga is one foot four inches. He's not even a foot and a half tall. Weather happens miles up in the air. <laughs> you know how much cold air he'd have to breathe being this fucking tall to reach where the weather happens up there to make it fucking snow? <sighs> Game Freak, what the fuck are you doing, dog? Alright, so this is a female. First name, three middle names. Okay, we're gonna do first name only. Alright, this is a female vanilla light. And we gotta randomize the name and get everything about it as well. So, <laughs> this Vanillite is going to be named <clears throat> Whoa, 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 whoa! Make sure I spell it right. Guessing this is pronounced Porsche, and not just Porsche. But, <clears throat> she is American. How funny! Came out in fifth gen. Wow. She is American from New York in the United States. She's 30 years old, was born July 6th, 1989 at 137 AM. <laughs> She's five foot two inches, a little bit closer to the weather, <laughs> but only weighs 97 pounds. She's right-handed, her blood type is O positive, and her future outlook Her death date is November 12th, 2039, at 4.20 a.m. 4.20? 4.20 a.m. So her lifespan is 50 years, and her cause of death is cancer. How unfortunate. But, <clears throat> everyone say, hi, Portia. <laughs> Get the fuck in a box. I don't want you on my team, though. Not today, not tomorrow, not ever. And don't be touching me, bitch. There's a bit of energy trickling out of the den. I gained 50W. I don't know what the fuck that means. What is, what is, what is that? I don't know how to access that. Looks like my dude, like this thing right here. And what the fuck is that? It looks like I'm shouting at the vanillish. Or no, it, is that like a, yeah, 
Yeah! And because it's in a Pokeball, like I caught it. Is that a kill feed? <laughs> There's a bit of energy trickling out of the den. I, hey, bro, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I'm just stacking W's, bro. I got honey. If you need honey, you come see me, bro. There's a Dynamax den down. Bro, this area is fucking colossal. Like jumbo shit, dog. What the fuck? Hey, that one is angry, bro. I do not want to go to that hole. Yeah, so apparently, like, when they're funky like that, I guess they have, like, egg moves or, like, guaranteed IVs or some shit. Well, this one got a light coming out of it. There's energy pouring out from the den. 300 W. Max raid battles. Pokemon Go. Defeat a Dynamax Pokemon and you'll get a chance at catching it. Additionally, there are some rare items that you can only obtain by battling Dynamax Pokemon. Oh, so we have Dynamax Lapras? Spoiler alert. What the fuck is that? <gasps> is that a Hydreigon? When wild Pokemon Dynamax, they become incredibly powerful. They may unleash multiple moves in a row and take other actions you won't see in a regular battle. Working together with other trainers will be key as you take on these Dynamax Pokemon together as a team of four. What the fuck? Oh, this is a Dynamax battle? It's Bug. So it's a Dynamax Caterpie? Do I have anything? Uh... He has Peck. Oh, what the fuck? I only get one Pokemon? Why am I this little girl? I'm gonna go with this nigga right here. I might get my ass whooped. If I get my ass whooped, can I do it again? The battle ends when Pokemon faint four times or the battle lasts for ten turns. Some trainers will join the battle. Why? Why can't I do a raid battle by myself? I do raid battles by myself all the time. Who the fuck are these niggas? Look at this big ass caterpillar. I can Dynamax? I don't know what the fuck Max Airstream does. Let's do it. I don't know what the fuck that means. I don't know what's going on! The fuck? This nigga just chucked this fucking medicine ball! Bro, what the f <laughs> What the fuck? Dog, this is not Pokemon anymore. This is some Naruto. I think it's just summon Gamabunta and the fucking slug that Tsunade had. Like, what the fuck is this, dog? Bro! This is like the hypest but least hype thing in the world because it's a fucking Caterpie. This nigga's Delmise just got oko by it. The storm raging above you is growing stronger. Max Airstream, I hope this does damage. Yeah! Where's I, nigga? No, bug it up. I did like a quarter. And that motherfucker that lost. Your Delmise, you're not helping, bro. Huh. Fuck it. Do it again. I don't really know what's going on. <laughs> Wait, is that a shiny Snorlax? Is that a shiny Snorlax for real? It looks like a shiny Snorlax. It could just be the colors, but it looks like a shiny Snorlax. Is this nigga gonna Dynamax? Oh, so each Pokemon gets to faint four times. I thought it was just like four total because there's four people. William, Janet, and Kit. 
Thanks, guys. I ain't never done this before. Y'all just hop in my fucking backpack. Welcome. This big ass Caterpie wants to end our existences. Caterpie is weak. Throw a Pokeball. Fuck it. Catch it. I don't give a shit. Will this nigga pop out the Pokeball? Well, I. Ugh! Every single time. Look at this shit. What the fuck? Okay, Game Freak. <clears throat> You're just being ridiculous now. This is ridiculous. This is so ridiculous. Like. <laughs> so, can every Pokemon be Dynamax? Or is it just like certain mons? Is it like Mega Evolution? Only certain mons can Mega Evolve? EXP candy. Oh, there's candies like from Let's Go. Dynamax candy, Paw Magberry, Tiny Mushroom, and the TM for Leech Life. Wow. Last I remember, Leech Life was a really good move because they buffed it. For protection, it releases a horrible stench from the antenna on its head to drive away enemies. Sounds like Sadie. Sure. Let's give this Caterpie a nickname. All right. <clears throat> that was a lot. That was a lot just now. It was very intense, bro. <laughs> and it was just a Caterpie. <laughs> All right. We're generating a name. This boy's name is as follows. It sounds like a wrestler's last name. Hartwin. Like... Introducing your new WWE champion, Earl Hartwin. <laughs> no, that sounds like a tag, tag champion from like the 50s. All right, so we have Hartwin, who is German from Bavaria, Germany, yeah. Whose age is 13. Birth date is December 9th, 2006 at 8.06 p.m. He's five foot six. That's a tall 13 year old. Five foot six, weighs 106 pounds, right handed, A positive blood type. His death date will be January 29th, 2071, at 2.34 a.m. for a lifespan of 64 years. His cause of death is. Heart disease. <laughs> I don't know why. Everybody dies of fucking heart disease. So, is there anything, like, special or unique about Dynamax Pokemon? Because, I mean, like, when you do a raid in Pokemon Go, yeah, I guess this just is, like, a kill feed. Just updates what's happening. But, like, in Pokemon Go, there's nothing special about raid mons that you catch. You just catch them. Okay, I'm all turned around now. I normally have a very great sense of... Okay, door's up there. Whoa! Big ass nigga just wobbling around. What's up, bro? <laughs> Fuck is up, bro. Oh, that Onyx. I whooped that nigga's ass. This nigga be about to fucking Oko me, bro. Oh, he's level 15. Okay. Come get this work, bro. I'll, I'll catch the nigga beat. You see, I said I didn't want to catch every single Pokemon. I'm pretty sure I did this in X and Y as well, where I was like, I don't need to catch every single Pokemon that's out here. But, like, this Diggersby is here now, so now I caught the Diggersby, I want to go catch the Bunnelby. I got the Caterpie, so now I want to go get the Metapod. And all that leaves is the Onyx. <clears throat> can we make this easy on ourselves, bro? And can you just... Okay. Don't want to do that. You'll hurt yourself. One time. Laser focus. You gonna concentrate? What is that? Up like your crit chance? Like your next move is gonna be a crit? If he hurts himself in confusion, will he crit himself in confusion? Bro, you're not even trying, dude. Gotta make a campfire. Gotta make a campfire now, bro. <laughs> you could have hurt yourself with confusion once, bro. Like, you could have helped me out just a little bit there, bro. I mean, then again, he did have a pretty decent amount of HP. I don't know what the fuck I was thinking. 
But I'm just gonna keep chugging Pokeballs. Cause why the fuck not? Bro. Every time I turn around, they both stop what they're doing immediately and look- Whoa! Hey! What the f- Cut it out, bitch! Just get in the fucking Pokeball! Damn! I can handle an Onyx that's 11 levels higher than you! Shit! <laughs> what the- <laughs> Anyways, every time I turn around, they both like stop what they're doing and just look up at me like this. Bro! <laughs> the fuck is happening? This is Gen 8, not Gen 6, bro. All right, so this was all just a waste. Thanks, bro. Cause you about to die to this hell right now. Appreciate it, dog. See now, my my drive to like catch them all is gone. This nigga just ruined it for everyone. You ruined it for the Bunnelby. You ruined it for the fucking Metapod. You ruined it for the Onyx. Fuck you, stupid ass Diggersby. You literally just sat here and wasted all our time. I know it was my choice to sit here and do it, but he could have gotten that fucking Pokeball. The nigga didn't even try. That ball shook twice once. Snarl. Um. Uh, what was a special attack? I guess. I guess. Why not? Why not? You know, at this point, everything's gonna be forgotten, anyways. Stuff cheeks. <laughs> Johan learned stuff cheeks. What exactly is stuffed cheeks? Okay, I need to A What is stuffed cheeks? Is that like the move version of harvest? The user eats its held berry then sharply raises its defense stat. Ah, oh, so he just gets thicker. Okay. Okay, so how do I... Everything you need to set up a tent and get cooking in a wild area or at a camping spot. Last I checked, I'm in the fucking wild area. Okay, I'm gonna come back to that raging hole over there. Hold up. Hold up. I made a lot of bad choices just now. <clears throat> but I do know that there's a fine young lady up here who will assist me. Hey! Thank you. Thanks. All right. Been playing this game for 40 minutes now. <laughs> right back to where I started. <laughs> Rolling fields wild air. Okay, so I'm going to... Oh, there's the onyx. No, I'm not doing it. I'm not wasting any more time. So I catch the onyx. It's a fucking butterfree. Who the fuck is this nigga right here? Okay, he'll be my marker. From the entrance to him. Everything to the left of that I haven't explored yet. Everything to the right. Like I said, I'm going to go back to that uh, Dynamax hole over there. And see what's going on. So he'll be my marker. Love to cook, you've come to the right place. I got all the finest ingredients right here. Fried food. Instant noodles. Pre-cooked burger. Mixed mushrooms. Pack of potatoes. And fresh cream. Mmm. 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 Well, none of these are... <laughs> this is what happens when, like... <laughs> Like, I started working out and eating healthy and everything. So now it's just, it's like subconscious. I'm like, none of this is healthy. I don't want any of this. 
I don't know. I'm not. I'm not worried about it right now. I'm not worried about it right now. I'll come back to you, dog. But he's still gonna be my marker. Whoa! Hey, not interested, bro. I do want this though. Why? Thanks. That jackass dig. Hey, bro, come here. Come here. What's up, bro? That's so cool how they don't just automatically charge you. He was like, hey, what's up? All right, catch you later. Then I ran that nigga down. It's hailing. This nigga's level 33. Can I just disappear in the mist? I really don't want to do this, bro. I just healed all my Pokemon. Why are you doing this, dude? This is what I deserve. I didn't leave him alone. Thank you, bro. Appreciate that one right there. Oh, he disappears for good for good? Whack. If you run from him, he should still be chilling there. So that you can re-encounter him. A single Pokemon, a very small... Hmm.